Hey y'all, it's Nick from Undefeated Productions, and welcome back. In this one, we're going to be discussing the trade that sent Jason Castro from the Los Angeles Angels to the San Diego Padres. Before we get started, hit that like button and subscribe. Again, we are now currently less than 24 hours away from the trade deadline. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Lots of names are throwing out. Joey Gallo might be traded. So make sure you hit that notification bell so you're notified when I upload. All right, this trade is actually a fairly, fairly good trade for the San Diego Padres, who have gone out and acquired Mitch Moreland and Trevor Rosenthal previously, and now they're adding Jason Castro to that mix. Jason Castro, so far in 2020, is hitting 192, two home runs, 707 OPS, and he's driven in six runs. Career-wise, Castro is a 231 hitter, 88 home runs, 703 OPS, five stolen bases and has a 313 on base castro last year broke out onto the scene that's where we big named him and got him a little bit of a paycheck he hit 232 with 13 home runs last year for the uh, twins and that paid him 6.85 million dollars in the 2020s uh, season now the angels have seen enough of castro and they are deciding to trade him for gerardo reyes who is a relief pitcher and this uh, and hoping that reyes is able to bounce back and go into this angels bullpen and help out their staff Reyes career-wise has a 7.62 ERA in 27 games, 26 innings pitch, 38 strikeouts, and a 1.346 whip. So San Diego here has traded a middle of the end, uh, like Brink 40-man roster player for a catcher to pair with Austin Hedges. So now you have the offense to your defense. Castro will complement Hedges behind the dish. And overall, I think this is a great trade for San Diego. You guys are picking up a catcher, a left-handed catcher, that is providing a, a more offense than Hedges and Mejia will this season. And if you're the Angels, you're getting a okay uh, player. I don't think I'd part with Castro, but again, it seems that you guys are rebuilding. You're talking about uh, trading Bundy, talking about trading Anderson Simmons. Uh, I could even see Justin Upton if anyone's going to take his contract going out the door. So it looks like the Angels are going to tear it down. They're going to rebuild some more and try to build up for next year. But overall, let me know what you guys think. Comment below. Hit that like button and subscribe. Again, more trades coming your way, and I'll see you all in the next one. Thanks for watching.